Hello guys and welcome back to the Dutch campaign on the Poland Total War the Great War mod. Where we last left off we took Paris. We have split friends in two. And if they would... Can I get peace? Can I get rid of France and move on to Great Britain? Peace. Uh, let's, let's also... um. Let's see, do you want to censor the press? I think that would accept- I would think- I would take that as more of an insult than anything. It's like, oh, uh, I see we took your capital, you know, you might want to censor that from your people. But yes, um, I'll give them this, uh, piece. Oh my god! Parasex- I did not expect them to sign that. I- I honestly didn't, but- We took Paris- and now, we're, we don't have to deal with those, those guys. But we are on a border with Italy now. Uh, Russia, not a problem, so it's just Italy. And we can trade with Switzerland now. Um, yep, there we go. Uh, my economy has flourished with the addition of um, France there. Yeah, this is, this is great. This is honestly great. Now Great Britain is a target. You know, I could have, like, conquered all of the North, but that would have taken so much time and so much effort. I've got what I wanted. I got more than I wanted. And now, here we are. So, yeah, next turn. Okay, so France wants military access in exchange for, um, mass production and 10,000 gold. They also want, um, the mortar, which, you know, I'm not too bothered about. It's the military access that I'm worried about. I think that's just to go and fight Germany, which I don't think is a problem. As you've seen here, Austria's actually come up and taken the old German land from Russia here. So it's Austria that's fighting, um, uh, Russia here. So I don't know where Germany is. They're still like the strongest nation in the world and I am going to accept this. Just for mass production. Why did that turn red? Are we at war again? I just kind of signed a peace treaty. Are we... Nation join... What the hell, France? I just... Signed! Peace! You just traded with me! No. Okay, France is dead. Forget that. France is dead. There is no negotiating with these French scum. We have to kill them. It's... It's apparently that simple. I gave them stuff for a piece, and then they took it, and uh, nine months later, not nine months, uh, two weeks later, sorry, a, a bit different. I guess, actually, no, we just had the Christmas truce. I just realized that. It's next year. We just had the Christmas truce. That's in the streets of Paris. The world united in a Christmas truce. That's all that happened there. Anyway, we have a lot of gold and not many men. So let's get some men. I guess we just sit here. You know, it bought me some time, at the very least. So yeah, next turn. Okay, blockade has happened once again. Uh, workers' rights in France, um, yeah. It's gonna be a problem here. It's always gonna be a problem. Let's see. I don't really want any cavalry. Again, they're not too helpful, so... Just gonna, uh, we'll just get a bunch of riflemen to garrison here. And then I guess I conquer the rest of northern France. Maybe Aquitaine, and then just leave him, like, locked to the Mediterranean. 
I never wanted to go this goddamn far in France. I just wanted to kill Britain. Who are now, like, the only major power that I'm not fighting and is not my ally. Along with Austro-Hungary, but seriously, they're, they're my allies. Do you want to be friends here? I mean... I guess. Now it's every major power besides Britain has taken a side. So I... I don't know. Spain refuses to be friends with me because they're friends with France and Britain. Sweden is like trying to dominate Scandinavia here. Could I ally with like one of the countries here? Um, Sweden? No, you don't want to be friends, uh, your allies with my ally, uh, yeah, not much I can do. I guess next turn. Oh, wait, um, I actually never changed this, uh, what do I want? Scrap drives? Let's see. Fascism? Do I want to be a fascist country? Probably not, because people already hate me enough. Uh, destroyers or aircraft carriers, um, sniper scopes. Yeah, let's go for the rail system. Now, do. Ah, uh, yes. Now, next turn. Oh, oh God, why? Um. Okay. I'm not complaining. I honestly am not complaining. This was literally best case scenario apart from I will fight Great Britain for you. But why? Why did you declare war on me to give me money for peace? It's like, did you go to the people? It's like, yes, we're at war with the Netherlands again. And, you know, people's like, wait, what? Are you kidding us? Are you kidding me? We just lost! We just lost Paris to them! And then, you know, a month later, because it's a month later, like, oh. What's that? We we haven't taken Paris back? The, the people have not rose up in the streets? Oh, well, just, I guess we do peace, you know, just give them the rest of our treasury. Why? I don't know. Thank you. Please do not join the enemy again. I wouldn't put it past- THEY DID IT AGAIN! <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh god, why, friends? Where does it say it? Did I miss it? I probably missed it. I think it said, um, Peace Treaty signed and then immediately after, Nation joined your enemies. French rebels, I, 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 I don't know, I don't know, guys, I don't know, um, wow, so they declared peace and then Italy politely asked them to rejoin and it's like, well, I guess we can, you know, we did just pay them for peace and we're kind of going back on our word for the second time. But, you know, that's fine. It's all about war here. That's all France is now. It, they're all about the war. Let's leave some... Riflemen here. You know, go. Just go. Yeah, they're running off. We'll... We'll head off the main army here. And they're, they ran away. So I guess we followed them. Yeah, uh, I'm just going to hope that turns out okay. Probably won't turn out okay. I'm just going to make a save real quick. Hold on. Okay, uh, before I do that, I want to swap the tech over. Let's see. Do I want TNT? Yeah, we'll go with that. Okay. Next turn. Airplane detected? What? Um, what's going on? <laughs> oh, oh my god, that's great! That, oh, that's brilliant! 
Oh my god, that looks so cool! It's just a floating plane! I mean, it looks a bit ridiculous next to the, like, giant of a gentleman here. It's like King Khan. It's all the little planes flying around him. Sir, there's a giant uh, French gentleman here. Uh, we're, we're gonna try and fly around him. Anyway, a super dreadnought uh, made by the German ar army. We've got um, more gentlemen here. Oh wait, is that Dutch? Is that mine? That's mine! I thought it was French! No! I got my own plane! Oh, that's amazing. Let's, um, let's infiltrate here. Yeah, we've got a ton of people. Uh, can I... No? Is... Are you telling me this? I can't... And I shan't, because I can't click. Okay. Uh, we'll go to you, our other man in the field. Yeah, let's, let's duel. Let's duel here. Your job is to kill any and all Frenchmen. Okay, let's just wrap this up. We'll auto-resolve. Uh, we lost 99 men, and they lost 2,000. 2,500. The rebels have... Well, they're all the way over here. Let's start making some howitzers here. I can afford it, I definitely can afford it. The commercial sector, do I... want that? I mean, it makes them happy, so I guess we... do. Uh, let's see here, we'll have a better garrison. We'll... upgrade these. Because we can, pretty much, we got the money. And, uh, yeah, next turn. Oh, wait, can I, um, select him by this? Is it, uh, you? Okay, I I've selected you. Duel, let us go for this man. Okay, let's watch, yep. Uh, still using muskets, you know, uh, the old, the old rules are the best. Um. I, we won! <laughs> uh, yes, it was a victory for us because we didn't shoot properly. I mean, we were using ancient technology by this point, so... Yeah, take that, friends. We, we can throw guns better than you. You know, typical Dutch response. That's not even... Why did I even say that? That's not even true. A typical Dutch response to throw guns. Because that's what the Dutch do. Uh, yeah, I have no idea. Uh, next turn. Okay, got another guy. I'll just put you in here. Let's go back to that duel in and, um... Yeah, France is trying to take Paris back. And I'm gonna say this right now, not gonna happen. They're probably gonna try and siege me out, and by then... Uh, my guns will have got over there. So what I'm probably gonna do is just round this off by... trying to kill them. Okay. Don't... Don't throw your gun this time, man. So where's the guy in the blonde... Not the... Blonde? The powdered wig. Who's... Uh... Victory? Much? So that's why you don't look down the barrel. Why does it say 
Oh no, it doesn't. It says your opponent killed. It doesn't say that you killed him. So, that's probably why you should use a gun. Or not duel. Uh, you know, either one. Oh, we got a guy right here. Okay. I want a clean fight and don't look down your gun. Did my guy die? Um. Nope, nope, he's wounded. Because he ran away. Maybe he, he heard what happened to the last guy. Oh, um, Rush is actually taking land. They've actually, um, isolated it. He's Prussia here. Okay, well, I think I'm just gonna call it here, so... We had some successful dueling, some less successful dueling, uh... You know, Paris is flip flopping all over the place with this war. Uh... I could actually, like, make a protectorate if I take this city, if I take, um... Brittany here. So I'm gonna try and attempt for that, I'll see if I can make, like, a second army to go down there. Probably not gonna happen, I'll probably take Normandy and then... Move on. Could have a Norman invasion! Or Norman-Dutch invasion of Great Britain. Anyway, I'm trying to get back into recording, so this will be the uh, one part of this session. So, thank you for watching, guys, and I hope to see you next time when, you know, we probably just destroy this army here and then move on to Normandy. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you then. Later, guys.